Thanks to everyone who has subscribed. If you have not, please do. And thanks for coming out here. I really appreciate you. Islamic movement protest in Abuja against France president bonds flag. Hey, Nigeria. So they can protest, Abi. Protests can still continue in this country. When they told us we cannot have answers to end police brutality, they are forming solidarity with France with, um, you know, Islamic movements across the world. I tell you sincerely, religion is part of Nigerians big problem. You know, that sentiment of uh, this is this, this is that, that is part of what has kept Nigeria in the cocoon that she is. We have some people will tell you whether Buhari is performing or not, let him remain in president in presidency. He must complete his tenure. So they don't care whether he works or not whether it's working, whether the government is moving forward, whatever is happening to Nigeria, whether Nigeria is going into a dish, they don't care. So long as he completes his tenor, he's from the north. You know what we call prejudice? Mm -hmm. Guys, let's get straight into the news and understand what is going on right now. They've burnt down, uh, you know, France uh, flag. And some of them are in France, so they will not leave the country. Oh. Some have even bought tickets to go next week. Oh. <laughs> oh. Let's continue, my dear. It's called uh, hypocrisy. <laughs> Islamic movement protests in Abuja against France president, Bond's flag. <laughs> they want to start something they cannot finish so that uh, they will say Nigerians are in solidarity with whatever. Please, guys, be wise. Oh, be wise. Members of the Islamic movement in Nigeria on Tuesday took to the streets of Abuja. Nigerian capital to protest against France President Emmanuel Merkel over an offensive pronouncement on Prophet Mohammed by a citizen of the European country. Members of the set in large number marched from Entel Junction to Wasu Market and set the France flag ablaze, leading to Pampandium in the city. Secretary of the Academic Forum of the Movement, Abdullahi Musa, said the rally was aimed at condemning the action of France president over the derogatory pronouncement against one of theirs. He said, we set the France flag on fire in reaction to the attack on Islam and Muslims by the, French, by the president of France, Emmanuel Marco, since his heredious crime of publishing cartoons of, pro of the prophet by the magazine Charles Hudo. The protests terminated at Warsaw Market and forced vehicles owners to use alternative routes. As at the time of this report, there were no security agencies on ground. Recall that the Federal Capital Territory Administration had last Friday deployed anti-riot policemen and water canals to the National Mosque in anticipation of a protest by the members of the IMN. My people, so it's happening now in Abuja. They said they are doing a protest because uh, Emmanuel Merkel, the France president, said a derogatory word against their own uh, and then they did a cartoon. Hence, they are burning the flag. You see, uh, so this is what is happening in our country. Uh, Why this is going on, you heard the end. If you listen closely to the end of this whole uh, news, at the time of this filing, not a single uh, security personnel is on ground. I'll tell you what. See, yeah, on Sunday, uh, our very own brother, Omoy Alesho Ware, started the NSAS protest again. Before they could even put themselves together to say Jack Robinson, eh? Soldiers were around, and it was not a small battle. Soldiers were on ground, and I mean, it was something else. Face off, I mean, you, we, we reported you, we reported that news to you. Up to the time of this report, not a single personnel is on ground. Not a single one is on ground. But if another group comes up to say, answers come up to say, for what will better Nigeria? See, we need to get our priorities right. 
we need to get I I I I I I don't take any offense to anybody believing in you know whoever they believe in. I don't take any offense to anybody standing up for what they feel is right. I mean, is your fundamental human rights you should be accorded that respect. But I'm talking about misplacement by our government. Nigerians came out to speak together to say enough is enough to evil going on in our society. But guess what? They wrote, nobody, all these people did not stand up to say, let us stand together as one unit. Nobody. They all stayed in their own various cocoon. As a matter of fact, one guy graciously came on air to say that he's just stating it out here loud and clear. Anybody or anyone who wants to protest and does not want Abuja to have peace, they are going to deal with the person, blah, 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 blah. We reported you with that, with that, we intimated you with that report that this was what was going on on the ground. Guess what? <clears throat> it's happening now. Same thing, you know. There's a common saying, we're growing up, my father will always say, what is good for the goose is good for the gangas. We need to be honest and fair and honest to ourselves. We need to be true to ourselves. Youth came out in this country to say, it is time for us to end police brutality. We must stand together as one and end evil in our, in our society. Nobody stood up with the youth. Too. As a matter of fact, a young guy who is a, an APC member came on air to say anybody he sees, uh, you know, in protesting, they were going to do A, B, C, Z to the person. As a matter of fact, one on Ome was killed in the protest in, a, a, what's it called, in Abuja. When hoodlops attacked, they stabbed him in different places. He bled and died. We reported you and we presented you that video. Apple Line Media, we presented you that video. They came on ground to say, no, it cannot be. Anybody who wants to ABC must come through them, blah, 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 blah. How can we behave like this and expect change in our economy? It cannot work. It can't work. Because if people, if we don't, if we are not of one mind and true intention for change, if we don't really want change, it's not going to, it's not, it's not just going to happen. We have to really, by the time of this filing of this report, not a single pe uh, security personnel was on ground to say, why are you rioting? Who gave you this? Who gave you that? Nobody. Can you see that the agenda in Nigeria is gradually hashing up and every one of you keep quiet and think nothing is happening? Be wise. Leave us a comment. Let's hear your thoughts. Have a lovely and a fantastic day. Thanks for always being there. God bless. Bye for now.